Welcome back to another episode of FTB. I've got my jetpack. We got the Jim's building his place right here. A lot of marble in this place, Jimothy. Got some nice little um what are they called? Uh I forgot what they're called, but they've got he's got some nice little ones of those. <laughs> he's got rooms and rooms. This is very well done, Jimothy. Look, this is a bedroom, it's got closets. This is the sort of thing I want to build. Great job, Jims. I like the Jims. He's a, he's a good builder. He's very underestimated. If he made videos, he'd probably have a whole lot of subscribers. Here's Michael with his windmill. I think he had that built last episode. Not sure if I showed it, though. Uh, what else is going on at spawn? I don't want to show Baj's stuff. Uh, well, I think all his stuff is underground, but that's his building there. Anyways, lots going on. That's Zistel's been working on the hub. Another hub for everybody. And that's what it looks like. Uh, Nebris, I'm not even sure where Nebris is. But the industrial building here is expanding. It's getting bigger every time I look at it. And here's my little house that I've been working on. Um, I built some stuff, so let's take a look at it. Uh, first of all, I put in this wall with a door, with doors. This wall, I think, matches this wall on the floor nicely. I built this fireplace out of multiple blocks of stuff brick uh, I expanded this to be a double sink because the kitchen one's a little small over here I want this to be all wide open um, so yeah I expanded this I put this on this this little counter here on the this side of the fridge um, double sinks as I said I put my floor in for my bedroom I'm gonna use the light wood planks I'm not sure what color to make the walls though they're not gonna be gray you guys got to keep in mind this is the outside of this block. I could put any color I want on this side. I think I'm gonna go with like a red wall with a couple of gray walls and maybe a white wall. We're not gonna we're not gonna keep it all the same. We're gonna change it up. I'm clever like a fox, Anders says. <laughs> so I wanna build some more power tools today. Nobody on the server has built a jackhammer yet. And I wanna build one. Um I'm pretty sure oh and a chainsaw, but I don't know if I'm gonna build a chainsaw this episode. But first Jack Hammer. Diamond, a diamond jackhammer is what we want. So we need um, an energy crystal, a circuit, I believe, and diamond dust. And I think we've got... Oh, what the? How did that happen? Energy crystal, circuit, advanced circuit, diamond dust. So we need two... How did that get in my inventory? That's weird. We need two uh, titanium ingots, right? Two tiny titanium ingots? Yeah, so let's go. Let's go take care of that. Uh, so we have a tiny pile of titanium dust. Hmm. Now we have a larger pile of titanium dust, and we need two of those. Done. Let's put this back here. Let's go over to um community uh, stuff. M M Platinum Making Bay Baby. Man, I don't understand what he's saying half the time. Induction smelling operation you've got there. Oh, I guess Nevers is visiting um, Anders. These guys are all about their their machines and stuff. I want to build, but I do want power tools. <laughs> so we're going to make a jackhammer. I'm not sure if there's any difference between the jackhammer and uh, this bad boy. Uh, the advanced diamond drill. They probably work the same, but um, I want a jackhammer. I'm pretty sure you put... Oh, I don't want to touch this. Oh, there's nobody here, though. Maybe I should touch it. Sulfur goo? Why is this chest open, and why is there sulfur goo on the floor? I don't know who it belongs to. Is it... No, it doesn't belong to this chest. Is there any more here? No, he probably just threw it out of his inventory. I'll hold on to it in case he needs it. I didn't want it to despawn. Okay. No? Is this not happening? Is this not what we're supposed to do? Titanium dust? Oh, man, I keep forgetting how to do stuff. Okay. Titanium ingots. Industrial blast furnace. Okay. Is something wrong? Incomplete machine casing. Oh no, what happened to the industrial blast furnace? This is not good. Um, what 
happened to the industrial bl blast furnace? Incomplete machine casing. Yeah, it's missing like 18 blocks. What are these things? If I can make these, I don't know what they are though. Let me see. I don't know. I don't even know if it gives you the uh, industrial blast furnace. Just take the casings from the implosion compressor. Okay. Um. <laughs> Which ones? The lighter. Oops. Lighter ones or darker? I don't know if there's a difference. There probably isn't. Not the corners. Oh, okay. Okay, not the corners, he says. Sweet. Sweet. And you will need all but two. Okay. Oh, I love this diamond drill. Advanced diamond drill. All but two. Well, this is dangerous stuff. I feel like I'm defusing a bomb here. <laughs> Maybe not, but I'm still not really sure how to do this stuff. You'll need all but two. Okay. Let me take this one, these then as well. Let me fly straight up here. I guess we need one more. Uh oh, are we stuck? No, we're not stuck. We're we're fine. Everything's fine. Okay. Oh, what the heck? What is happening with this sulfur goo? All right, Everest is coming. Just to. Uh, 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 uh. Mm -mm. No. I think the middle needs to be empty. There we go. I think we're good. I think we're good. Yes. Hey, Nebs. I keep picking up sulfur goo. You need it. It like keeps appearing from here. I don't know what's going on. This game! It's from Aluminum Torches. Nope. Oh, okay. Okay, so it's this thing that keeps producing it. Weird. I don't know what it's for. Let me see if there's any uses for it. A crowbar? I guess that's cool. Switch lever. More switch levers. Red metal posts. That's cool. <laughs> Kitchen is beyond beautiful. Uh, thank you. Oops, thanks you. Thanks. Okay, we got our titanium. There's one. Oh man, I want to make that jackhammer and test it out. And then I'm going to show you guys a bunch more stuff. Come on now. Come on now. I guess he's running show on the, or show short on these casings. Um, I wonder if I could build some for him. Casing? Is that? Oh yeah, there it is. Standard machine casing, reinforced machine casing. How, how much? Is, oh, advanced steel, advanced machine block, with some steel ingots. I could build some for him. I think. Come on, one more. Yes. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready for my jackhammer. I will take it now. <gasps> oh man, I'm excited. Jackhammer time. It's time to hammer some jacks. No wait, that sounded bad. Forget that. Forget I said that. By the way, I want to make my um my uh fireplace automated at some point. Have some um fire charges, fire some fire charges, or have a Dispenser fires some fire charges to the nether rack so it lights up and shuts down automatically with a little button over here. So yeah, eventually I'll do that. But right now we're gonna make a jackhammer, and then we're gonna test it out because jackhammers are awesome. Um, okay, here it is. 
Diamond Jackhammer. Okay, now we gotta charge it, I'm assuming. Let's go charge it. Actually, we have our we have our lap pack. Let's just use that. Wait, do we have to charge zero? Oh, maybe if it runs out, it probably doesn't the lap pack won't charge it. Is that what's happening here? Probably. Let's charge it. Oh boy. I'm excited about my... Oh, wow, it's it's charging. 100,000? Wait a minute, that's a whole lot. It might be better than the advanced diamond drill. Who says hi? Pack rats? Probably saying hi to somebody else, not to me. Oh, by the way, my uh, quarry finished digging this out. Oh, my God. <gasps> oh, I thought I had my jetpack on. <laughs> Oh gosh, I am laughing out loud. Classic. <laughs> oh man, that sucks. I totally thought I had my jetpack on. <laughs> Long fall boots me. Um, thought I had my jetpack on. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't lose stuff. I don't think so. It's all over here, right? The bad part is the darkness. Ah, the classic thinking you had your jetpack on. Make sure I have all the good stuff. Here. Okay, my diamond drill. My, this thing. <laughs> my lap pack, we have... My sword, which is not that important anyways. Shovel. Uh, my axe is here. My, I think we have everything, actually. Pretty sure we have everything. Right? Right? You guys would let me know if I missed something. In the comments. Oh my god. You left your flux capacitor down there. Okay. Alright. We're good now. Now I'm going to put my jetpack on. I can't believe... You guys probably thought, too. What's he doing? Um, okay. There we go. Hover mode disabled. Way up we go, super fast. Oh, we got a we got a visitor over here. Where is it? Right here. Okay, jackhammer done. Sure is. Man, that was that was silly. That was silly. I think I probably had like close to thirty levels too, but I don't really care about levels. And it's raining. What a surprise. Okay, here goes the jackhammer test. Holy crap! Holy crap, it is so much faster. Ouch. <gasps> ooh, ooh, ooh. Major slowage there. Oh, man. This jack hammer is crazy fast. Um, I want to dig. I want to dig somewhere. Oh, wait, I know what to dig. Oh, don't, 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 don't. Right here, right here. There's some there's some stone here. Come on, get in there. Oh my god. Does it dig ores? Oh, it doesn't dig ores. Okay. So the jackhammer is good for like construction work. Holy crap. But not for ores. Man, if you want to dig out some cobble real fast. <laughs> you know, the good thing about it is actually it's it slows down quite significantly when digging through ores. So you can like do stuff like, no, no, like this. <laughs> and it'll never dig out that ore because it's slow. Ooh, I'll take that. Thank you, sir. Oh my god, this thing is amazing. All right, I have the jetpack this time. Oh, I guess it wastes pretty fast too because of all the stuff it takes. But my lap pack is amazing. It's got a million, ten million EU. Is that? Is that? Is that a million? A million. Oh man, I can't stop. This is this is great times. <gasps> okay. All right. Up we go. Oh my God, that's so good. Oh, there's my phone again. Wait. Where the heck am I?
I looked away for a split second. I don't even know where I am. It's cool. Everything's fine. Ooh, okay. Let's do some housework. We're going to put in a ceiling today real quick. I think I'm going to go with wool for the ceiling because it kind of looks like spackle. Popcorn ceilings, you know what I mean? So yeah, I'm going to collect some... Ooh, i got to turn hover mode back on. There we go. Oh my god, this jackhammer. I love it. <laughs> Holy crap. All right. <laughs> Time for some ceilings. Okay, game just crashed there. I've been having a whole lot of trouble with game crashes lately, and I'm worried. Uh, okay, let's let's do this. Uh, let's just put one there like that, just to start it off. Sweet. I think longfall boots are very cheap. Yeah, I sh should make those. They really they really are cheap. They're just like obsidian and and some other stuff. Really not that expensive at all. I probably should make some. Look at that guy. Look at that guy. Oh, I have no arrows either. Dang it, and my sword's almost dead. It's okay, we're just gonna ignore him. We're just gonna ignore him. This is gonna take forever from up here. I probably should go down here. Okay, guy. I don't like you in here. Could you go away? This is why I also want a mining laser. Because you can use it as a weapon. Don't, don't, don't blow up. Don't you blow up my acacia tree, I think is what it's called. Yeah, my game keeps crashing lately. Like, uh, FTB, uh, vanilla Minecraft, it just crashes like, like it's nobody's business. And I'm worried. By the way, the top here, I'm going to put some strips so that doesn't look completely... Actually, I might not be, be able to with the glass. No, I think I will. Look at this. This is this is perfect. It's like a popcorn ceiling. Oops. And we are just about done with the ceiling. Let's make it official. Let's, oh, is the oh is the fire gonna burn? I hope not. I think the fire is safe. <laughs> the fire is safe. There we go. Oh, it's starting to feel a little cozier now, isn't it? Mm-hmm. The only thing I'm worried about is this this thing here. It does not look 100% like I want it to, this window. I'd rather have it in the middle, but I don't know if there's a way of doing that. Let's play around with the glass panels here. Glass cover. Yeah, let's just do that. We're not going to use... We're probably going to use thicker, like, triple glass panels. But for now, we'll... Use the basalt. There it is. Smooth stone and we're my diamond, my diamond thingy. <laughs> uh, two of them. Let's do another one. Four of them. Let's see if this works. If not, I'll probably make this a floor to ceiling window so that looks a little better. So we can do this for sure. I knew we could do that. And that looks a lot better already. But can we also put the glass up there? <sighs> we cannot. Ooh, this is not good news. Hmm. Uh, let's try this. And now, let's try... Yeah, we can't because this is an inside wall. Wait, is it an inside wall? Yeah, it is. Hmm. Hmm. Well, we got to figure this out. Um, just break that panel and put that back up there. I think if we put it on the inside here, oh yeah, we'll be fine. This is this is exactly what we need to do. Let's uh, let's add this one. Oh crap! Damn jetpack. First world problems. Complaining about your jetpack. If we do this so that there's a little ledge, that's perfect. Yep, that's the one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's put a let's put the rest of them just to get a real feel for what's happening here. Oh, that's not the way it's supposed to be. Um right there. Perfect. Long fall boots, here I come. Oh, that, that only makes one. Oh. One? Can you put on one longfall boot? 
Seriously? <laughs> no. So you need to craft two. Then why not just double the recipe? I don't get it. That was kind of silly. Six iron again. That's kind of weird. Why would they make you make one at a time? Why not just make a requirement that you put two or something? Longfall boots. Okay, so now you got to pair them. Yes. Boom. Longfall boots. Oh, man. I am like... I am ready for war. <laughs> Let's uh, let's test these bad boys out. Um, how long can you fall with the long fall boots? That sounds like a riddle. How long can you fall with the fo long fall boots? Uh, nope, this is not the way we need to go. We need to go over here as far as you want. Wow. Awesome. Let's test them out. Um, I do have my jetpack. Oh, okay. Whew, okay, Anders is gone. Um, what what do we do here? We're gonna do it. Leap of faith. Oh gosh! What? They don't even wear out. Wow. Op. <laughs> Yeah, is that supposed to happen? Like, that seems very overpowered. I mean, I can understand long fall a bit, but they're just boots. Well, yeah, but you can fall from the top of the world. I don't know. And they never run out. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, one, Um. while I still have you here, don't leave me. While I still have you, let me just do one last thing here. We're going to start production of our energy. I consider it compensation for all the expensive stuff we carry. Not fun to lose those from a jump. Indeed. He is right about that. Alright, so. we uh, I got rid of my quarry. I have a little bit of space down here. Where's my engine? It's up top, isn't it? Um, Can I get up through here? Let's, let's try this. Oh, does the jackhammer work on dirt? Oh, it does not. So only for stone. Hmm. Okay. That's fine. It still cuts through stone like nothing. This is the engine. This is the lever. Together, they are engine and lever. The hottest new band. All right, let's let's do that. Is it? Dang it! Where's where's the hole? Story of my life. Let's get up there. Come on. Let's grab one of these. We're going to start generating power from our magma crucible. That's right, folks. We're going to generate power. <laughs> I'm like the Tim Allen of the server, really. Okay, so here, uh, let's... This thing eats through dirt like crazy. Oh, maybe I should make this my, my shovel and this my... No. Because then I couldn't pick up ores with this. Um. Okay, magma crucible here okay yeah that'll work actually can we let's do it like that and now let's power this bad boy up uh let's power it from the other side over here because I, I want okay here we go stuff is happening right Energy is being generated? Sure is. Okay, so now we take our geothermal generator, which is over here somewhere. I believe it was in the same chest, and I could have grabbed it at the same time. But efficiency is not my strong suit. Uh, back here? Yes, geothermal generator. By the way, I made one of these things, electrolyzer, and I didn't even need it. Uh, <laughs> that's when I was trying to electrolyze my bauxite. Bozite, however you want to say it. And, uh, turns out, I didn't have to do that. So let's do this. Now this is going to generate lava from netherrack. And then that lava is going to be transferred. But I think I have to, like, configure... Um, blue, maybe? No required low. 
I think it has to reach like 5,000 millijoules before it starts making netherrack into lava. And from here, this creates an infinite source of power, really. All I need is some netherrack in here, and I'm good. And the lava just flows in. I should make a tank, actually, for some overflow. Uh, how do you even make those? Oh, not, not chat. Tank. Uh, like one of these. Oh, that's simple enough. And I'm going to leave it up to you guys in the comments to tell me if I'm doing this right, because uh, this is this is new to me, just like a lot of the things I do. Now, I think if I put, let's make, uh, I think one, uh, let's make two just to be safe. They don't overflow, correct? As far as I know, they don't overflow. Oh, there we go. Does he have the same setup as me? No, he's got a different setup. He's got a magma crucible, though. Then he's got. A, a lava tank which feeds into electric maybe the lava tank is just for for storage because no be careful can blow up okay I'm not gonna touch it a pulverizer all right this is his magma crucible so he just fills up the lava the lava tank but from there this electric furnace is not being powered by the lava. It's got to be powered by something else. Oh, I think it's MFE? MFE? Oh! It's probably underneath here. Okay. That's fine. He's got the same sort of thing going, except I'm using uh, solar power to create lava. So I can put... <gasps> oh, you bastard! You bastard! You bastard! Oh, you scared the crap out of me. Still no arrows. Where'd that creeper come from? This vile sword sucks. Where'd this guy come from? He's probably coming from... Yeah. From places like this. And that hole I created down there that's not lit. Okay, do I have my jetpack? I sure do. It's running out of juice, though. Let's just light this up real quick. I could have just blocked off the entrance, but I'm going to be safer and light it up. Please don't run out of juice. Please don't run... Oh, yeah, I got my longfall boots. Doesn't matter if I run out of juice, does it? Problem is, it doesn't provide any protection. So, yeah. I wonder if you can combine the longfall boots with... Your regular with the nano boots, probably not. We generating any? Oh, there we go. We've got some lava. The lava is not going into there. So, is that what we got to do? Yeah, there we go. Drains the lava right into the geothermal generator, and now I can generate more power in addition to my water cells, water and fire, powering my base. Um, I think I'm gonna call it here. Oh, I did want to put this on. I could put it along the side, but I like it like that. So when it overflows, it fills this up. And I'm pretty sure this won't overflow. But it's going to be a long time. Man, as soon as I get this filled up with lava, this thing's going to power me forever. I'm thinking. Maybe not. Maybe I'm crazy. All right, that's it for this episode. Hopefully in the next episode we get to make the chainsaw, another power tool. <laughs> We're gonna make all the power tools. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> and uh, we'll finish off some more rooms or a another room, I guess. There's one thing I did want to add here. These lights. I love these things. They look really, really good. Uh, let's power above the kitchen here. Oh, yeah. If I put another one, it's gonna look great. I could even inset them, actually. Maybe we'll try that before we go try to inset a light fixture. We can do like pot lights. Ooh, pot lights. Um, I got to even it out though here. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So the middle would be 
One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. My window's lined up. Okay, so let's start here with one of these, and if it looks good, we'll use it. We'll use it. Alright, we got a nice little hole there for our light fixture. Ooh. Pot lights? Glass panel. Oh, man. That looks pretty good. I think this might be a little thick, though. How about we cut it a little bit further and see what that looks like. Put glass covers on it. Oh man, that looks really good. Now imagine all these. Every like five blocks or so. Ooh. What a great place we have here. I feel right at home with my long fall boots and my derpy looking hat. Oh, that's one last thing I wanted to try before I leave. Oops. I want to try. I doubt this could work, but who knows? It's worth a shot. Whoa. Hello. So we'll open this up. We'll put our boots in here. Still have two of those. Can I put the long... Oh! <gasps> you got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. Um... Nope. It does not work like that. Dang it, that would be so awesome! Oh, that would have been great. That would have been really, really good. Oh, man, why? Why must you not work? Damn it. <laughs> okay, well, that's sad. It looks, they look like, like, high-heeled boots. They look kind of a little bit feminine. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. There's what I did there for the pot lights, and I can continue that theme, and then we'll put a roof on this bad boy. It's going to be it's going to be purdy. It's going to be real purdy. The outside walls, I still need suggestions on what to do there. Um, i got to build a couch here. By the way, I know the walls look bare, and you might not like the stone, but trust me, once I get some shelves up, and some paintings, and some decorations and stuff, you guys are going to love it, I hope. Um, but yeah, that's it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode, and I will see you all next time. I'm thinking I might change those panels to something else inside there. <laughs>